Uh, I was in a bookstore one day and this dude said, you want to know the real truth? And then he pointed a one dollar pamphlet to me and I took that book home and read it that night and a light came out of the sky, surrounded me and told me that I need to eat raw food. It's the answer to all my problems. Raw food and fasting and I've been on that journey ever since. Eleven and a half years of, of raw food commitment. Working my way towards the fasting and living properly so that I can live a divine life on planet Earth and set a good example and also reap the rewards of following those patterns that take place in nature by following nature's laws to the best of my ability in this insane world. It's changed everything. I mean, it started out with the food. I was a bodybuilder by day. A, and I had drug issues at night and on the weekend. And, um, you know, through the raw foods and the cleansing and the fasting and the detox, I managed to get sober and really uh, begin a, a service oriented type uh, lifestyle on the YouTube. So I'm a completely different person. I am a devoted to the Most High Holy Light now, and I just seek that out to the best of my ability and try to help other people through. It's, I call it illumination through health, or spiritual enlightenment through the path of health. Well, it started out that way. It started out as vanity and food, and there's still vanity and pride there. Uh, but I'm working on that slowly but surely, but it really brought me to a very driven, spiritual place. Driven in a way that it's, it's not so much me, but it's my heart. My heart is really searching for something, and my mind can only call that God or divinity or transcendence or some type of um, eternal freedom and instead of uh, these little prisons that seem to take place in the mind of I'm not good enough or I'll never be able to do this or you know the negativity or the obstructions to the to the flow of that perfection that seems to exist but it sometimes it comes and goes but if you really open up to it and the more clean you get from the diet that you eat the more that you see uh, that and feel and experience, and that's what we want. We want to see and feel and experience those changes and that beauty and that light and that divinity. And then we want to touch others with that and just by being what we are. Mm -hmm. So we change the world, not by what we do or what we say, but we change the world by, by what we allow ourselves to become because the divine light is in all of us. So really, with the food, we're just trying to remove the blockages to the awareness that we are divine beings here on planet Earth. And it would be very nice if we just loved one another and especially loved ourselves. Loving yourself allows you to love others so much more easily. That's the basics of the message.